The coronavirus pandemic has affected many areas of our lives, including our finances. 10 News anchor Heather Walga recently caught up with Lena Kornmeyer from Bank of America for tips on how to ease some of that strain. Lena, good to see you. Thanks for being here this afternoon. Thank you for having me back. It's good to see you too. You know, COVID has impacted a lot of areas of our lives, especially when it comes to our finances. And a lot of people have lost their jobs or they've had a sudden drop in income. Is there something that people can do to get help immediately? Absolutely, absolutely. First and foremost, know that you are not alone and that there is support available. As bankers, we wanna connect with you and help you deal with whatever you're going through. If you don't have a banker that you feel like you can talk openly with, now is the time to get a new one. We've also got some tips for you today from bettermoneyhabits.com to help you start making that plan. All right, so let's talk about some of those tips. One of those is taking advantage of government help. What are some of the options that are available? You know, there are four key areas under the CARES Act that offer immediately uh, relief immediately that you can take advantage of. We're looking at student loans, mortgages, income taxes, and unemployment. All right, let's unpack some of those. We'll start with student loans. What can you tell us about that? You know, interest on federal student loans right now is at 0%, and you can also suspend payments until September 30th of this year. That doesn't necessarily apply to private student loans, but many lender lenders are offering payment deferral programs. And you talked a little really bit good. about mortgages as well. How can people get help there? Yeah, for those with federally backed mortgages, you might be able to qualify for payment suspension. So contact your mortgage service provider for more details on that. All right, and um, another thing we wanted to talk about, if, if people have bills piling up, I know a lot of people are finding themselves in that situation. Even with government assistance, what are some things that you can do? You know, always, first and foremost, it is really important to not ignore your bills or allow them to pile up. You know, we get nervous about things like that during these times. So reach out to your creditors to let them know of any changes in your situation. You might be surprised at how forgiving and understanding creditors may be during this time. So don't be afraid to ask for help. What about when it comes to paying your income taxes? What can you tell us about that? You know, really great this year that they extended the deadline to July 15th, 2020. That is coming up, so don't delay. But for those of you that, you know, were able to take advantage of that relief, you've got a few more weeks before you have to file. That is good news. I know a lot of people will be happy about that. Um, what suggestion do you have if you're looking at your monthly budget and you're trying to come up with ways that you can cut that down? You know, you may already be saving money in this current environment. You know, a lot of us are still staying home. So you're probably, you might already be saving on some expenses like gas, meals out, and entertainment. But you really want to make sure that you're not paying for something that you're not using. So look over your credit card statements for reoccurring charges to make sure that you're only paying for things that you're actually using or doing. Yeah, we all have a lot of time on our hands. I know I've gone through mine and realized that I'm paying for things that maybe I shouldn't be. And I'm saving money on not eating out as much, which is good. I think a lot of people are happy about that. Yes, um, absolutely. Where can people go for more information if they want it? Yeah, absolutely. You can always go to bettermoneyhabits.com to check out these tips and more. Or, or you can visit any of our four Bank of America Knoxville area locations. All of our lobbies are opening are open and we are taking every precaution to keep you safe during this time. All right, Lena, thanks for being here. We appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you for having me. Great to see you.